What's up everybody, Gundam Flexing here. We're going to do an unboxing video of the High Grade Freedom Gundam or long for ZGMF X10A Freedom Gundam piloted by none other than Kira Jesus Yamato from Gundam Seed. Here from the box art we can see various weapons um, mostly beam cannons, beam rifles, and the rail guns. Hopefully that would come in the kit. That's a lot, a lot of weapons, which will be great. Great box art, too. Great series as well. I haven't watched the second season, but I strayed away from it simply because of the reviews online. But the first season was fantastic. Here you can see the 35th anniversary sticker. You can see the front of the model. So it does come with the shield, and we do see a beam rifle. Colors, white. Dark gray, blue, so there's a variety of colors here. He has wings, and this is the back image. Nice. Okay, so his wings have also separate into multiple uh, multiple segments. I'm trying to get a good capture of that there. And we can see a variety of weapons, which I'm assuming are the beam cannons, beam rifles, and the rail gun. Um, just all over. It looks like it can even come around his back too, which is pretty cool. Various battle poses. Looks like he does come with beam sabers. That's neat. There it is. Okay, so we see the beam sabers here. Two beam sabers, shield, uh, and a rifle, and various other features on the top. Looks like it's mostly about movement. They call it gimmicks. You see that? It's his gimmick. All right, awesome. Side of the box is no different than the other side. Here is back. You can see a uh, segment, just art, mostly dedicated to the anime and the warning stuff. All right, so let's see what's inside this kit. Here. That. We have. One bag, primarily colors of dark blue, blue. You can see his two beam savers, and here are the stickers. So, obviously, you got them for the eyes. Maybe these are for the wings, for the wings or weapons, and particularly very small pieces here, and very, very small pieces here. Yeah, looks like these are also the wing, the uh, back parts too. Here we go. This is the second bag. Looks like dark gray, gray and white colors here. A variety of pieces there. Nothing in particular. Just, I could just right off the bat tell there's a skirt pieces and shoulder pieces. Nice. This one. There's another bag. Uh, here are some transparent yellow. The PC panel. And this is the B5. Is it B2. B2. Looks like right off the bat, maybe it has to do with the lower leg pieces. Not bad so far. And one more. One more bag. So we have a total of four bags. This one is dark red, yellow. I think this might be the fin. The B fin. Alright, so this is the B fin right here. And gray. Side. Let's look at the pamphlet. Here it is. Here's the finished product. Boom. Here is battle pose. Alright, so this gives us a pretty good comprehensive view of the finished product. So beam rifles, beam saber, it looks like a real gun. Nice. Looks pretty sick on a stand. Rifle. That looks like he has um, millimeter cannons. And a shield. Battle poses with swings up. Beam sabers. Battle pose with the beam saber. This is the final instructions back page. Here are more instructions. Colored one, so that's near the end. Yeah, more pages of instructions. Uh, 
strange how this one opens up is a little bit funny. Uh, so this is the this is the back page of the finished product battle pose. What it looks like in the back. Uh, you can place his rifle holster to the back skirt. You can grab two of his beam rifles or rail guns. Can't really tell. And here are the color guide. Interestingly enough, I cannot find the first. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Here's the first page. This whole thing is just opening up a little bit funny. Here's how many panels. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Not bad. Here are the instructions. So you first start off with the chest, chest piece, then you go on with the head piece, then the arms, put them together, go to the legs, then you complete the weapons. And the weapons, it looks like it has several pages of instructions. No, I'm sorry, those are for the for the wings. Alright, nice. And then you go into the colored pages that we just saw at the very beginning. But that's it. So I'm gonna get started building on this kit. And we're gonna see how the finished product compares to the final image. But that's all I have for this unboxing, guys. Thank you all for watching, and keep your eyes out for the next time lapse video. Peace out.